What's up YouTube, it's the Covenator here doing some more Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020. Uh, when we were last on I kind of did like a general impressions video, um, which I gave it a 10 out of 10 as far as very first impressions go. I want to be kind of making my way around all the different game modes. Uh, we did the flight training um, that I actually failed. <laughs> I plan to go through and do them all, uh, but uh, I figured this time we would try doing one of these live challenges. Now, the way these work is uh, they'll have like an approach to a real difficult airport. Like this one, you're literally like landing on the side of a mountain. You know, I mean, you're you're uh, you're going kind of a down and around and. Uh, laying in there and the winds you know you may have strong winds so they're they're challenges and the neat thing about it is these rotate out like every week or so and you're competing against other players which is which is kind of interesting so like you can look here and see who's the top dog and this is literally the top dog in the world so I mean, you're competing against everybody else so let's see uh, so it looks like it's every two weeks not every week a new time limited landing challenge um, I'm not sure, sure how you say that uh, Kerchevel ski resort in the French Alps very short runway no go around procedure. Yeah, you can see that. I mean, if you uh, if you botch this, there you're you're pretty much dead. But what a cool airport! Let's do it. Okay, so it looks like we need to be 80 knots down to 72 on approach. Got to make kind of a real wide turn here. A uh, six. 1,477 feet above mean sea level. That'll make things uh, pretty interesting. Alright, let's do it. For some reason my plane is wanting to really pitch up aggressively here. I need to adjust my trim. What a beautiful day. Alright, don't get distracted. Let's see if I can see the airport. Oh, it's coming up quick. I do not want to uh, turn just yet. Almost there. I actually do not see my airspeed at knots. I'm not really sure know what this is. Oh, the inner green circle is knots. I'm going way too fast. I am probably going to crash. This is harder than it looks. This is horrible approach, it really is. I should have swung out a little bit more wide, and I guess we're aim uh, aiming for that blue square. This thing seems like it wants to drop speed pretty quickly, which is surprising with how little of an aircraft it is too high. I think the field is made at this point. What What is going on with my throttle? My engine just stalled. Okay, we're dead sticking it. Oh god, I'm not even going to make it. Alright. 
there is something going on with my throttle. I noticed this when I was doing the uh, training video. I don't know if it's a problem with my with the actual HOTAS or the way something's mapped. Okay, how do I pause? Just take a look here. Oh, now look at that. That explains it. Okay, my uh, my throttle and mixture is mapped to my HOTAS, so that's why I'm stalling, because as I decrease throttle, I'm also decreasing mixture. And that is why. Welcome to Flight Simulation. Uh, sometimes you end up with uh, little quirks like that. I think what's going on, we'll have to... Let me take a quick look here. So... Uh, on the throttle... I bet you it's because I have two quad... I have two parts. So this can be... This can be separated. I bet you like this half is mixture and this half is throttle. So I need to actually fix that to where it's independent. Okay, we'll try this again. Okay. Mixture is full. Now I've lost Again. Now that I got things mapped correctly, I have no excuses. I couldn't believe how quickly I bled off speed. That was nuts. Okay. Way too fast. It'll probably bleed pretty quickly. That was horrible. Times a charm.
Alright, that wasn't bad. Uh, I had to go quiet there. That was like sterile cockpit kind of stuff right there. Uh, 658,000. So that ranked me in the top 15,000. Well, that was a lot better than the top 50,000. So, uh, it looks like, okay, so you get graded on a multiple, uh, multitude of things here. <clears throat> so I did pretty well on landing inside, um, that little blue box. Not, I don't understand what ground roll is. Like, do I get more points the further I go down the runway, or am I supposed to stop quickly? Landing smoothness. I got some pretty good points on that. I was, you know, you, you, when you land, you basically want to be as close to a stall as possible. Um, but I don't understand what ground roll is. But, uh, yeah, nothing, uh, nothing compared to, uh, the top dog. But, uh, I'm okay with that took a few tries that was a lot of fun so uh, it was a little little nerve-wracking okay yes I want to go back to the main menu now that's one thing that I have kind of noticed I didn't really notice it much on my first impressions video I was kind of distracted <laughs> but there's like a loading screen to go back to the main menu I mean really uh, this this whole user interface should just pop over the top of whatever you're doing. Uh, I understand that we need to load like from here to here and whatnot. So we've done the flight training, we've done the live event. Um, I have no idea. I guess these are challenges as well. But uh, got two different flavors. Looks like we got some more landing challenges. We have some bush trips long distance across remote locations that sounds like a lot of fun um, so I'll probably in the next video I'll probably do one of these I'll probably do the push trip um, or I might just uh, pick a pick like my home airport because I'm dying to like check out my hometown uh, fly over Hamilton Let's see if I can let's see if I can find it here. Butler County, it's there. So um, Yeah. Not really sure which one I want to do first, but uh, we will check it all out and we'll do it together and then after I feel like I've touched on all the different um, game modes in the simulator I will do a final review so anyways that's gonna do it for this video thanks so much for watching um, if you could please like and subscribe as that really does help the channel if there's a location where you would like me to fly or uh, if you want to give me some tips on what I did wrong on that live event challenge uh, just drop a comment uh, let me know. I'd uh, like to hear from you. So thanks again so much for watching, and uh, we'll see you in the next video.